It's him, Skid McMarks. That man from the Infobot. In the flesh, little dude. You guys get a load of that epic space battle I was in? We saw ya, screaming for help. Uh, that was like a war cry. My agent and I got ambushed on the way to hoverboard practice. Did he survive the crash, sir? Yeah, he's okay. But I've had a little trouble getting back to my ship due to my sprained ankle. Oh, come on. If you can take out all the sand sharks, I just might have a spare hoverboard for you. We'd love to help you, Mr. McMarks, but Ratchet and I need to find Captain... Shh. One of your boards? Hmm. I've always wanted a decent hoverboard. Well... All right, you just keep that foot elevated. Nice. I love that line. Okay, this part is actually a little bit difficult sometimes. Come on. I don't trust it when my uh, when the computer goes into a screensaver. Okay, this part I could die because I haven't done this in a while, but we'll try. This part does have awesome music though. Oh. See, this is actually like one of my favorite. Well, I think just lag for a second. Yeah, this is one of my um favorite tracks in the game. And it's like, it's not even a main theme for a planet. It's, can I break this? I'll break all the other ones. Alright, the only one that can't be broken. I'm getting a decent amount of bolts here, though. What? Nope. Come here. No. Oh, okay. You see those weird things over there, if you see in the bottom left it says how many sand sharks, and in the bottom right it says how many of those weird yellow things. Remember how we were only supposed to take out the sand sharks? So what's that? On! Notice how the sand sharks are coming back up again? That's because these yellow things are sand shark generators. We need to kill those or else we'll never finish this sand shark thing. There are actually a good amount of sand sharks. I'm surprised I haven't taken a hit yet. Now that I said that, the very next sand shark I fight, I'll take a hit on. Ah, no. All right, now. Wait, 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 wait. I don't have the camera turned around. If he ambushing me like that, that's not cool. This is why I need the fire fighter. Trying to do this with a blaster would be a nightmare. Trying to do this with a bomb glove would be even worse. Get out of here. Surprise these stupid generators take three hits to kill. No. I knew that using the bomb glove would probably have me take a hit, this thing is incredibly slow. It's like, see how Ratchet sort of gears himself up to throw the bomb? It's horrible. Um, I get it. This whole place is pretty much just sectioned off. So... How is that it show? Wait, actually... Let's pull out the blaster. This guy from up here save us some trouble. Feel. Pretty sure that yeah, I'm pretty sure you can't kill the shark. Holy crud! Can you kill the sand shark from underground? I just found my new strategy. Uh, <laughs> one thing you have to know about me: I'm incredibly cheap at times. When the situation calls for it, I'm cheap. Oh, 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 sweet, bolty goodness that I didn't have to do anything for. The bomb glove is good for something. It's not like I'm totally against the bomb glove. No. Let me just go back and check to see that I didn't miss any exception. Nope. They're all over here. Wait. I only see one generator. No, there's two generators. This part's crazy. As you can see, there are 19 sand shards. Oh, thanks for missing. Ugh. There we go. Wait, 
Wait a second. Doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I thought they'd kill themselves. Guess they can survive in the, um, uh, Okay. Doesn't really matter what I do, because... If I don't take out those generators, it's just gonna be big green. More sand sharks. Snap! I guess the generators die in one hit of the Pyrocider, even though they take technically three hits to kill. Awesome. Nope. Get away from me. Get away from me. If I die here, I'll be so mad. Kill three sand sharks. You just run. You just run. You just run for a second. Oh man. I want to go back and get some health, because I'm freaking out right now. There's literally three sand sharks, and if they kill me, I will have to hurt someone. They won't, because I mean, I've got good enough weapons, but you know. Something else you gotta know. I'm a very paranoid person, and hell, while I'm over here, I'll get another gold bowl. I keep doing that. Once again, take out your bomb glove. Completely missed that wall, but okay. Yay! Free ammo! Oh, right! And this thing. Okay. Excellent. We're ready to go. Kill the rest of those sand sharks and get our new hoverboard. I don't even remember what the hoverboard's called. I think it has a name. If not, it just appears in our inventory as a hoverboard. Well, I'm pretty sure they gave me a name. Nah, I can't think of it. God. Two more. One more. Where are you? I'll kill you with the bomb glove. Oh my god, he's not here, is he? Yeah, he is. Ah! How do you feel? Yeah, you hit me. Here, man. Catch. A brand new Z3000. You can't even buy these. Well, I got a bail. Catch you dudes at the hoverboard races. You've just acquired a Gadgetron Z3000 hoverboard. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, so Z3000. I thought that was the name of the, um, the prize we got from the hoverboard races. That's why I couldn't think of the name, because I was like... I was like, it's either the Z3000... No, wait, isn't the Z3000 the prize? Get the rest of these bolts that I had to miss because of the cutscene. Wait. Come here. Can I break this one? Yes. For six bolts, but whatever. Alright. We have just finished off. Oh, right. I was just about to say we've just finished off already, but like I said, there are three paths, and I've only done two. So remember that path where I said, oh, that one's more fun? We're about to do that now. For that, we're gonna need the slingshot. And since there are no enemies, we can just hold on to this. I didn't die, right? No, I didn't die. Let's go this way. Gotta hurry. Ooh, give me that. Okay. Now then, what's awesome about this path is that it is slingshot level. This place has awesome music too. But the thing is, with every gadget, we get like a level where we really get used to the gadget. Like this, is, we get a couple slingshot levels during the game, but this is obviously the first one where you really have to get our slingshot skills up. Really, for the first real slingshot level of the game, this is ridiculously hard. Come on. Maybe they expect you to go to Eudora first? No, because the item we get at the end of this we need for Eudora, so... Okay. Of course, I've done this a hundred times, so this is not a problem. No, no, no! Crates, baby. So now let's go. Lots of explosive crates here too, which is awesome. Whoa! That was almost fail, but 
designed that nice. It wasn't really. This. Now go. Oh, look at that. Look at all these bolts. They are now mine. Okay. Whoop. Okay, we're ready to go. There is a skill point we can get here, and now that I'm not pressed for time, I think I will explain what skill points are. First, let's actually do the skill point and see if I don't fail this one. Crap! Let's try that again. 